Charles says it's too offensive. Here is the ad from Daniel Defense that they say can't air. Th this is tyranny. Here it is. It's been a long road getting here. And a lot has changed since I got back. Now this is the center of my world. And my family's safety is my highest priority. He's a Marine who comes home to his family and his baby. This is what they call offensive. I it is am offensive. responsible for their protection. Because he's a man in charge on a team with his family. No one has the right to tell me how to defend them. That's right. It's a good, clean message. That's why it's banned. So I've chosen the most effective tool for the job. Daniel Defense. Defending your nation. Defending your home. Used by the military and used by American citizens. And because it's so clean, so pure, so good, it's banned. They would never uh, have Obamacare propaganda about how the NFL supports the president and, and, and the and the the destruction of our already screwed up healthcare system by design, and now they won't let you run the most wholesome Daniel Defense ad, where it shows a father driving home, saying it took a long time to get here. He walks in the house, and it's a picture of his baby, his wife, him in the Marine Corps. He comes in, he closes the door, goes in and kisses his wife, picks up the baby, and then it just cuts to a website, Daniel Defense. And they said, quote, it's too offensive. And you know why? Because it's a loving father coming in straight and strong with his wife and his daughter. And they're a team. Uh-uh, you do not show that, period. This government is our enemy and is sworn to hurt everything good. My God, how obvious does this have to get, people? It's pure evil. You cannot show a father in a good light. You cannot show a man saying, I have a right to defend my family. No, you can put all the political commercials you want. You can have the attorney general meet with the media heads and say, we need to have nothing but anti-gun messages in the public's mind. We need to brainwash these people. And then you have that incredibly wholesome ad. Uh, the NFL said it's in prohibited advertising categories. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and play the prohibited ad that shows a dad driving home. He's driving home, regular neighborhood, regular car. It's been a long road getting here. Long road long getting there. Since I got back. He's a veteran. Pulls a weed in his now front yard. This is the center of my world. Now, the center of his world is his family. That's evil. The NFL is supposed to be the center of your world. He walks by pictures my of his family. safety is my highest priority. His family safety. A man protecting a woman and the baby. That is, that is blasphemy. Responsible for their protection. He's responsible. Protect his family. Blasphemy. And no one has the right to tell me how to defend them. That's right. Nobody has a right to say you can't protect yourself. That's a basic So I've chosen the right. most effective tool for the job. Daniel Defense. Defending your nation. Defending your home. Oh my gosh, that is so evil. Can you imagine in America, you think you can air that on television? That is offensive. And you know, they say I'm offensive too. And they say you're offensive.